head of spears shifts. A good friend lost to grazing. While the cat lounges. I appreciate your aid. One man against a pack of Mongols. Figured we'd even the odds. Thank you. Keep ambushing their patrols. We'll clear the roads and drive them off this island. The way the monkeys dance reminds me of a song my mother taught me. Let's see if I remember it. Hello, little one. Can't believe I almost lost Sora at sea. If he died, I don't know what I would do. my mother's old song again. She never wanted me to sit still. She taught me to play and move. Like a monkey.
Not bad. She would tell me to copy her bobbing her flute left and right, just to make sure I'd mastered it. I will say, it's hard to play when you're laughing. The eagle wants power, but not like Kutun. The poison she gave me. I saw her take a sip. Has she used it herself? Felt the torment she inflicts on others. If she survived these nightmares, maybe I can too. Flowers somehow bloom. A summit looms too distant. Streams never flow back. Canyon. My father died and not far from here. You cheated. I don't know how, but I'm certain you did. You owe me 20 mon. <laughs> Come, let's get back to camp. I was taught that debts owed to swindlers are not to be honored. Hmm. I was taught there's no shame admitting defeat by a superior opponent. <laughs> Next time we compete, I would like to inspect your arrows. You bring them on. I'll bring the arrows. One last battle. One final fight. Then we begin preparations to leave this stinking island. Par, speak with my father. Of course. Lord Shimura's stewards can collect taxes and tend the manure fields. Father, a word. Yes. Walk with me. What is it? After this campaign, don't you want to stay? Bring Iki Island under your control. It's not for me. Only in the battlefield are my homes. Would you stay and rule this place? I thought I would. But after everything we've been through, I feel more alive in battle than any other time. <laughs> uh, you are Sakai. What do you mean? Let the Shimuras of this world keep records and manage councils. We are the lightning in the storm. The avalanche that topples a mountain. That is Clan Sakai. I understand, Father. I once judged you soft. Unfit. Our oh, time together has given me... Lord Sakai! Pardon my intrusion. Our scouts bring urgent news. Yes. One moment. I must go. Prepare your things. Follow my lead today. Everything will be fine. What were you going to say, Father? What did our time together give you? I've often guessed, but we'll never know. They know you're here. They're toying with you. Creeping around like a filthy-minded criminal. Just words. Tell me, Jin. 
What is the most important virtue to a samurai? To act like a man and fight for the legacy of Clan Sakai. Those are your father's words. What does honor mean to you? Kindness. Fighting for people who can't defend themselves. That is the true meaning of honor. What shall I play for this one to calm him down? My mother taught me the song doesn't need to be simple to be calming. Then my father scolded me for disturbing her. She smiled, holding up my chin, and said, Peace doesn't always come quietly. I don't think either of us understood what she meant. Why didn't you help me? of me. Your father fell in battle saving his only son. His reward is a warrior's death. Now you will carry on his legacy. Did I make you proud, father? Everything. Yeah. 
stand watch at the refuge. Who are you? Thought I knew every face on Iki. Just a traveler. Stranded here by the Eagle tribe. You're welcome to join us. If you want to hear an old man complain about the past. We survived one invasion, and we can do it again. Or have you all forgotten how much we suffered at the hands of the samurai? That was nothing compared to the danger we face now. Nonsense. You are too young to know anyway. It's past time. I remind you all about the dark days of the samurai invasion. About the brutality of Kazumasa Sakai. Fifteen years ago, our home was invaded by an army of ruthless samurai. Their leader was Kazumasa Sakai, the Butcher of Iki. He rode to battle atop his demonic beast, shielded with armor as black as his master's heart. Luckily, the butcher made a grave mistake when he came to Iki. He brought his whelp of a son. Our bravest warriors hunted the boy, not to kill, but to tempt his bloodthirsty father. Kazumasa gave chase and rode into a trap. His armored horse met a grisly end. But the Butcher and his runt son survived, then fled like cowards. Enough of these lies. That is not what happened. I lived near Senjo Gorge. I saw it with my own eyes. So did I. Who are you? My name is Jin Sakai. Kazumasa Sakai was my father. He gave his life trying to help this island. Help! He murdered us! Your people repaid his help by murdering him. Is that why you're here? To avenge your father and take my head? You may be a liar, but you are not my enemy. Not yet. Stop this! You're acting like wild dogs! I came here to help, not for revenge. You mentioned my father's horse armor. After he died, we never recovered it. We know. Tell me where it is, and I can use it to ride against the Eagle tribe. I would die before I help a samurai. It's time you leave. Stay out. He knows something about my father's horse armor. He'll never tell me. Unless I listen in on him. Without being seen. You're not welcome here. Samurai, and I would have... Jiro! I lost six family members to the Samurai invasion. My sister was still a child. The way they were butchered, we couldn't recover everything to give them a proper burial. <sighs> that never should have happened. What about the rest of your story? Ah, yes. I was just getting to the good part. Kazumasa fell for our trap and lost his armored horse. As our warriors closed in, the Butcher and his boy fled into Senjo Gorge. The samurai limped through the canyon and ran headfirst into an ambush. There was no grand battle. Only a few raiders with dull blades. But that was all it took. One swing to end the life of Kazumasa Sakai. While the samurai slunk home, 
We recovered the armor from Kazumasa's mount. Over the years, our finest horses wore that armor. Every one of them killed its rider. As if possessed by the Butcher's vengeful spirit. So we sold his horse's armor to the Ida merchant family. The cursed armor left our shores aboard the merchant fleet as a storm descended on our island. The sky roared with the thunder of a thousand charging samurai, and the raging tempest shattered the Ida ships against our rocky coastline. The ruins of that doomed fleet still choke Zasho Bay, and somewhere in that watery graveyard lies the cursed armor once worn by the horse of Kazumasa Sakai. My father's horse armor is still lost in Zasho Bay. Armor should be on the merchant's lead ship, marked by the Ida family banner. Was it gold or red? Your horse wears this armor. He will feel your father's terrible bloodlust, and he that will kill you. So... 
my father's horse armor. We'll see if it fits Sora. Sit you well, Sora. Curse or not, you wouldn't throw me, would you, boy? You look just like my father's horse. May this armor protect you in battle. The evil tribe. They found the survivor's camp. Come, Sora! armor of Kazuma Sasakai, restored to his son, and cursed no more. After everything I said, you saved us. I am sorry for everything you lost to the samurai. I can't bring your family back, Jiro. But I will fight for Iki in their memory. You're better with words than your father. I will stand by them. Good. It's the least you can do. I never thought I would say this, but thank you, Lord Sakai. Monkeys love to play. My mother said you've never mastered a tune unless you could play with it, make it yours. Let's see how I do. Last time I improvised, she laughed. But the last time, she closed her eyes as she listened. The sunlight on her cheeks, her face serene. Even after seeing her sick, that's the face I'll never forget. That song, it's very beautiful, my lord. 
It's not finished yet. It's in memory of my father. Ah, uh, I apologize for disturbing you. I've packed your belongings, but some of your father's effects are missing. I'll look for them in just a moment. Of course, my lord. We'll finish this back at home, father. Lord Shimura told me how father broke this blade in a duel. Shocked by his strength, the Chikzen rebels surrendered immediately. We are the lightning in the storm, the avalanche that topples a mountain. That is Clan Sakai, some of my father's last words to me. A poem in my mother's calligraphy. I'm sure reading this, he could hear her voice. I wish I could remember the sound. Young Lord. It's time to leave. Lord Adachi, forgive me. I'm still collecting my father's belongings. Our scouts report raiders in the I am sorry we for must your go. loss. Know that we all grieve with you. Thank you, Lord Adachi. The people of Omi village are preparing your father's funeral. My men and I will escort you and your father home. Please, come with me. Yes, of course. saved him. His assassins would have killed you as well. Clan Sakai must prevail. Soon, you will wear your father's armor. I will never be worthy of it. My lords, our scouts report a large group of raiders approaching. I fear we must depart immediately. But the boats aren't fully packed yet. Our supplies... Leave them. Our people's lives take precedence. You heard Lord Sakai. Go! I ran from these memories most of my life. But now, after facing them, I think I understand you, Father. I tried to connect with you. But in the end, nothing got through your armor. You would always be a legendary warrior, chasing duty and burdened by the people who loved you. I hope I don't repeat your mistakes. I hope someday I can make peace with your death. Let us finish your song. What's the matter? I've been providing honey to local healers to help treat infected wounds. Someone must have informed the Mongols. A large group's heading this way. You should leave immediately. I can't. The original hive was damaged. These starter hives are all that's left. I write them poems. Sing to them sometimes. I won't abandon them. Mm. Take shelter inside while I hold off the Mongols. Angry bees may be a help.
No, stay inside. Come out now. The bees and I thank you, my lord. <laughs> While I was inside, I wrote a poem in your honor. <laughs> Noble honeybees, he defends our hives and queens. Do not sting him, please. Your dedication is uniquely inspiring. Suppose you can tell we don't get many visitors. Jin from Yarikawa. You outdid yourself this time. My men returned safely, and Fort Sakai is in our hands. We finally have a fighting chance against the Eagle. Any news on her whereabouts? Not yet, but I did learn something. While you were busy, my scouts recovered orders the Eagle sent to her shamans. It sounds like she wants to capture a samurai. Did she name them? No, but I think we can guess who she's hunting. What I want to know is, why does she want to take you in alive? The Eagle captured me when I first arrived. I escaped. But maybe she wants to finish what she started. What aren't you telling me, Samurai? Fune, Jin, we were searching for the Eagle. Lost her, but then we stumbled on one of her patrols. Tracked them all the way back here. The cliffs outside are crawling with Mongols. We had to sneak back in to avoid being seen. The Eagle knows we're close. She's going to find us. Hmm. She's retaliating. This is payback for her warship. And the death of her lapdog, Kumbish. We can evacuate to the ship. Abandon your home now, and you'll lose it forever. You'd rather die here? We could draw them away from the refuge. Fight them on land. They outnumber us. So do the samurai. You know the terrain better. What about an ambush? Somewhere we have the advantage. Kita for the village. We have a plan? Round everyone up, Tenzo. We need to go now. I sent scouts ahead of us. They'll lure the Eagle's forces to Kidafre village. I've got people preparing an ambush. What about the people who live there? It was about... The butcher of Iki destroyed it. Your father put the entire village to the sword. And you did nothing to stop him. The lookout tower. We got a good view up there. Our scouts will lure the Mongols here. We can't be sure where exactly they'll come through. Get people in the most likely places. A few of us on horses can hold back. And respond where we're needed. Like stopping a wildfire. We need to cover a lot of ground. Where should we position the men? 
place them among your father's innocent victims. Uh, the tree line. Station people there to keep watch. If they see something, they can signal us with those fireworks we took from the ship. Uh, set them off the moment your people see the invaders. Then we ride in. Mm. Hide people in those houses and granaries. Where your father's victims hid. Terrified and weeping. And if the Mongols don't get close? Have riders ready to hit their flank. Force them in range. What would you do there? The moment the villagers saw your father's men approach, they knew they were doomed. That was where they fell back. What? Who fell back? Um, where we could fall back. If we're overwhelmed. We'll reinforce it with whatever we can throw together. Get everyone in position. We'll hang back for now. They don't know the horror your father inflicted here. The horror you failed to prevent. Ride to your posts. Signal when you spot the invaders. You said that was where they fell back. You were here. When your father massacred the village. It wasn't a massacre. What do you call armed men slaughtering an unarmed village? A village hiding armed fighters. And their families. The people who lived here ambushed our patrols, set traps that maimed and killed our warriors, slit their throats while they slept. What did you expect? You came here to kill us! A friend of mine grew up in this village. After the samurai left, I found his body. But it took me a week to find his head in all the mud. I'm sorry, Tenzo. You're sorry. Do you have any idea what it's like to find your friend like that? Do you know how many lives your father destroyed? Too many. If I could change that, I would. But you didn't. Others had to end his cruelty. And I watched him die. I could have saved him. But I didn't. Why not? They're here. Get to the horses. They're coming. Get ready. They're attacking! Tenzo! Jin! With me! Strike hard and fast! If the Mongols overrun us, we'll fall back here. A group will stay to bolster these defenses. Fighting on the side of your father's killers. What would he say? Run them down, boy!
That's all of them. <laughs> Easy pickings, right, Jin? A good start. Fireworks! More Mongols on the way! Mount up! Let's go! This is just like the old days. She's enjoying herself, remembering how they slaughtered the samurai. Quickly! Let's ready a welcome for the Mongols. There's a few drums of black powder on those carts. You've been busy. Here they come! Aim for the barrels! That's the last of them. We held them off. For now. You'll never forget the sight. So much blood. The ground was soaked in it. Devastation all around you. Look what Kazuma Sasakai did. The butcher of Iki. Quiet. More fireworks to the west. We can't keep this up forever. Let's go. Feeling all right? Yes. Keep moving. <whistles> Bune, you think the fallback defenses are ready? I will keep them need more time. We'll hold back the invader. Hold up. Fireworks stop. We had lookouts close to here. I don't see them. Might be an ambush. Let's take a closer look. They've captured the lookouts. Hang back. I can sneak in. Surprise the Mongols. Oh, <laughs> 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 
you'll be free soon. I thought I was dead. Thank you. More fireworks! On all sides! The Eagle Tribe's making its move. There are too many of them, and we're spread thin. We're out of time. Everyone, get to the horses. Retreat to the tower. We'll face them there. Lead the way, Samurai. Fall back. Fall back! You meant time for now. The defenses are ready. All the invaders here. We make our last stand. Push them back! Smash the invaders! Benefit all beings. I've heard that before. From my father's killer. You're hearing things. It's the eagle's poison. Say the prayer for yourself before I end your life. Do it. On this blood-soaked ground, 
where your father massacred hundreds. He was trying to save lives. You knew who I was, what you did to my father. You lied to my face. You lied to yourself. Your father was my enemy, not you. How did someone so worthless defeat Kazuma Sasakai? I don't know. I... Luck! He slaughtered dozens of us before we brought him down. I broke his leg, I think. All I did was finish the job. Get on with it, Samurai! Not yet. You killed my father by luring us into an ambush at Senjo Gorge. That's how we're going to kill the Eagle. We need more than the two of us. Talk to Fune. They meet me near the canyons. We can't hide who you are anymore. But if I tell Fune... Do it. Tell her I'm Jin Sakai. She knows I fight for Iki. My actions prove it. Tell her I am not my father. If I was, you would be dead. <laughs> 